Hi all. It's late at night. It's actually after 12 and I'm too lazy to get up and turn the light on. So the light from the computer is giving me the light. Uh, what I want to talk about is cholesterol and statins and Lyme disease. How do they all come together along with fat burning and cannabis? Well, very interestingly, and I just found this out the other day, the bacteria Burgdorferi that is responsible for Lyme disease, as well as the Helicobacter bacteria that's responsible for um, ulcers. And of course, I have known this in the past before my brain knew as much as I know about everything else when I used to teach microbiology and the early uh, 2000s when I moved to Colorado. But th those bacteria happen to have cholesterol in their membrane. It's very unusual. Bacteria usually don't. And where do they get it from? They get it from host cells. And what we have to keep in mind is that uh, we, on the one hand, synthesize five or ten times more cholesterol than we consume. So statins... Um, are inhibiting our internal production, but they're not going to stop us from whatever we eat, which is significantly more. So right off the bat, you know, again, big pharma doesn't make a lot of sense. However, it turns out that because these bacteria require the cholesterol, I think the combined use of statins along with a ketogenic diet would be extremely beneficial for Lyme disease. Of course, the ketogenic diet alone is going to be beneficial because it's going to turn on fat burning, which turns on recycling of free radical damage components of the cell. Um, so I think that this could be a very important adjunct to using high-dose cannabis so that the CB2 receptors turn on uh, the fat burning. And then by using the statins, we're eliminating all internal production. And I think between the two of those things, you would have a good chance of uh, knocking out the bacteria. Now, of course, we need cholesterol as well. So we would need, of course, some dietary input. But maybe not for a few days, you know, because just recycling cellular components with fat burning in conjunction with the statins to prevent any synthesis uh, might alone be a, a final cure for that illness. Just a suggestion, easy to check out for somebody who's suffering severely, and some people are suffering severely. Have a good night. Bye.